example two chapter one consider this picture for the problem in this picture there is a rotating disk with a liquid between the rotating parts and the uh, surface fixed bar rotating part and fixed bar and oil film thickness between the rotating bit rotate with the omega uh, with this description an oil film of viscosity mu so we have viscosity and thickness equals to h and the rotating disc r radius of rotating disc between a solid ball and the circular disc the disc is rotated steadily at angular velocity omega so omega is angular velocity which angular velocity steady noting that both velocity and st shear stress vary with the radius r so the another information for this uh, problem is the velocity and shear stress vary with the radius r Yes, yes. Now it's a function of of R. So derive a formula for the torque M required to rotate the disc. Calculate the the torch M to uniform rotation. It is demands will show with the yellow part. In the next page we are going to solve this problem with the, our now mu H R and the picture consider this picture again for solving the problems if we want to show the disk from the interaction between the disk and the surface and oil we have a, an area here for example with R and the thickness is dr the radius is r so we can calculate two relation for this element which is da 2 pr dr and dm which is equals to the force multiplied to the R force is the tau dr pressure multiplied to the multiplied to R. This is dm and also we have a relation between omega and tau. Tau equals to u the u on the y yeah, as a uh, or a, a general formula and therefore this case we have the relation in the form we have this relation for du on dr for example in the we 
in this case we have the formula r multiplied to omega v and in the tension we have v equals to zero and according to previous formula tau equals to a mu y on h for uh, uh, rectangular and for a circular we have tau equals to mu omega r on h so we can write the formula dm equals to we have from previous knowledge m equals to f multiply to dr so dm in this case we have dm equals to force which is tau da multiply to d uh, r tau equals to this formula mu omega r on h multiply to dr which is 2 pr dr multiply to r so we have a relation for dm as a function of r in the next page we can write dm equals to tau which is mu omega r on h multiply to 2 pr dr multiply to r dm equals to omega mu r 3 2 omega mu r 3 on h multiply to p d r m r from 0 to r to omega p u h r 3 d r which gives us the formula p u omega r 4 on h 2 h this is the relation between the uh, momentum and the uh, the uh, magnitude of omega which is external moment and the uh, uh, viscosity and also geometrical uh, specification note that the, the relation between the tau and for example in the in this case r dr and the relation between the tau and the velocity will be described in the next example and also next chapters